we present Face Forensics Plus Plus, learning to detect manipulated facial images. We are confronted today with potentially manipulated visual content in almost any digital medium. Images and videos, particularly of human faces, play an important role. However, with current methods from computer vision and graphics, videos of politicians or news speakers can easily be altered. Face Forensics Plus Plus analyzes both manual and automatic detection methods and proposes a robust detection approach using a novel dataset. Since news speakers and journalists are likely to be prominent targets of video manipulation, we use corresponding videos downloaded from YouTube to create a video pool of pristine footage. Based on this dataset, we use state-of-the-art manipulation approaches to create altered videos. The two main manipulation categories are face replacement and facial reenactment. Face swap is a lightweight approach that extracts the face region of one image, places it into another, and can be run on smartphones. We also consider deep fakes, which is a learning-based face swap approach based on two autoencoders with a shared encoder. It uses Poisson image editing to merge the manipulated face with the image. The facial reenactment category is covered by face-to-face, -face, which transfers the expressions from a source actor to a target actor while preserving the target actor's identity. Using these manipulation methods, we created a database with 1.4 million altered images based on 500,000 pristine images. For a realistic scenario, we consider three different video quality levels, raw, high, and low quality. Based on this dataset, we evaluate the detection performance of human observers and automatic approaches. In a user study, we asked human observers to detect fake images randomly selected from our database. The ability to detect fakes decreases with lower video quality. Instead of such a manual detection, we propose a new method to detect fakes automatically. Rather than use the entire image as input, our approach uses a state-of-the-art model-based face tracker. This information is used to normalize the image input. Using this input, we evaluate multiple classification methods. Here, we show the results of our detection pipeline based on exception net in comparison to the baseline implementation which does not use any domain knowledge. We are able to reliably detect fakes of low video quality. We can also use our pipeline to classify the used manipulation method. Another important task in the field of digital media forensics is the per-pixel segmentation of manipulations. We can see that our method is able to robustly detect these regions. We have introduced Face Forensics Plus Plus, a domain-specific detection approach that is trained on a large dataset of more than 1.5 million manipulated images. We have made this dataset publicly available to the digital forensics community to improve manipulation detection, classification, and localization of fakes and images. Thank you for watching.